What's up everybody out there on YouTube? Back again, one more review. Mendoza Craft. Find me on Facebook, Mendoza Craft. Find me on Instagram at Mendoza Craft 1. Gonna go with the usual review here. This is a shop belt, WWE shop belt re-leather. Uh, customer sent it out to me, wanted more of a classic uh, cut. So that's what we did with the more classic Reggie box. And the uh, WWE stamped in. Since it's WWE, not dead WWF, we're going to do it like this. And that's what we went with. Left to right. Here we go. We're going to start, as always, with the Tramp Stamp. Mendoza Craft. Snipe Box is the very classic Reggie. The one with the uh, edge beveled in and then pear-shaped all the way inside. Of course, we went with the uh, WWE here stamping. And the space here between the uh, snap area and the tooling. Shell tooling with the texture all the edges are burnished already tooling around the uh, property plate tag team there 2x5 on this side 2x8 on the other side it's pretty standard uh, we're going to flip around take a look at the back leather came out pretty good Customer doesn't have a belt tip. He didn't send it in. He forgot to send that in, but I have my own. I made sure that fit correctly. Here's the back. No wrinkles. No crinkles. No weird bumps other than the uh, the uh, leather nips here on the back. Everything came out really, really smooth, really nice. I'm going to flip around again. Belt is nice. She will hold herself up under her own weight. It's not going to collapse or anything like that. Do anything weird. There we go. Plates are really nice. Of course, they're uh, shot plates. Cut came out very, very nice. Happy with it. Customer's happy with it. That's what's important. To do things the way the customers want them to be. To come as close as we can to what the customer wants. Very, very nice. I uh, didn't like the shop tag plates, but after doing this one, they looks pretty, pretty good. Very shiny, nice dual tone to it. Plates are about, I want to say, I'll say about six millimeters thick, 6.5 maybe. I don't know what the actual thickness of them is. Of course, they could have used more curve. Uh, I don't really recommend curving these whole solid shot plates. I don't know if the plating is going to crack or do something weird on there. So I think the best thing that they curved was the property plate that's got a little curve in it that's probably the best curve in the whole thing and it's probably thicker than the side plates looks real good and I'll pop on my uh, my uh, tip here just to show you guys the fit there it is what it would look like with the tip on there nice and flush not really nice but this just stays here is mine okay guys if you like this, hit me up. Anything I can do for you. Remember, I'm here. Christmas time, I got 10 kids to feed. You know what I'm saying? I got a Christmas tree that isn't a Christmas tree. I cut it off a tree, it's just a branch. And I decorated it with hooks and stuff to make it look like a Christmas tree. It's sadder than the Christmas tree that Charlie Brown put up. So hit me up guys, give me some work, keep me busy. Uh, again, Mendoza Craft here. Hit me up on Facebook. Mendoza Craft 1 on Instagram. I also have a TikTok. I put plenty of the uh, videos up of the work I do and things like that. Edges are burnished on this one. Looks really nice and smooth. Feels smooth. Guys, this is probably going to be one of the last videos. See you next year. Have a good Christmas. God bless everybody. Leave it better than when you found it. And when you find it, bring something to make it better. Later, guys.